It is pressure cooker time in the Champions League. Four teams are left and the stage is set for an enthralling semi-final. Who will make it through to the showpiece event? It's Manchester City. They take on Real Madrid and it's coming up next on EA TV. <laughs> Good evening and welcome. There's so much to be enthused about going into tonight's contest here at the home of Manchester City. I'm Derek Ray and delighted to have Stuart Robson sharing commentary duties with me. And we're getting down to the wire in the UEFA Champions League. Tonight, the first leg of the semi-final coming right up. It is Manchester City facing Real Madrid. Well, this is what the Champions League is all about. Some of the world's best players, two excellent teams and a great stadium. Let's hope we're not disappointed. Here's the Manchester City lineup. Ederson stands between the posts. Ilkay Gundogan plays alongside Kevin De Bruyne in the centre of midfield. And handed the task of playing up front is Erling Haaland. And here's the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. Federico Valverde plays with Vinicius Jr. in the wide areas. And the main goal-scoring threat provided today by Karim Benzema. And underway now in this Champions League semi-final first leg. Manuel Akanji. Gundogan. Rodri. Now they're on the scent of something positive. Delivered into the area here. Well, it's actually ended up being easy meat for the keeper. Not a great pass. John Stones. We're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. John Stones. And City get the throw in. Chance to play it in. Rodri. Superb block. Oh, great defending. Well, not many would debate the point that Erling Haaland is a joy to watch whenever he's out there on the pitch. But what should we expect from him today, Stuart? Well, oh, Derek, big chance here. And there it is! The first goal in the semi-final! A huge moment! Extraordinary scenes! Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal.
So City get things going again, and the onus is on them to erase the damage done by that concession. Gundogan. De Bruyne now. Well, considerable progress made by Gundogan as the attack continues. And that's sound goalkeeping. And fired over by Kroos. Not a touch off the defender, last of all. So a corner. And taken short. De Bruyne. Stones. The referee has decided to give the free kick decision the way of City. Really a very poor ball. Manuel Akanji. Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. And he takes it away. Benzema. Timely interception. And they do like to press whenever they can. Chouameni. Aurelien Chouameni. Now with Benzema. And slipped through by Karim Benzema. And the shot just over the top. Doesn't have to do it on his own. Rodri. Now with De Bruyne. Determined defending. Well, he really read that brilliantly. Camavinga. Throw into Manchester City. Mares. Perfect tackle. Benzema. Superb block on the back of the ball from the flank. Under real pressure defensively. Will they pay the price? And a good take under duress there. Stones. Kevin De Bruyne. And now, Stones. Well, they want that equaliser, but the passing remains smooth. Well, cleared away, but at the expense of a corner. Well, it's been a while, but these fans are now coming to life. Can they equalise here? And over it comes, just far too close to the goalkeeper. 
Chouameni. Here's Valverde. Benzema. Vinicius Junior. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Benzema. And that was a move of great promise. They could easily have been in. An attack full of promise. Luka Modric. Luka Modric. Oh, we have just witnessed a special moment. Pure quality. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And the finish is so clever. He just gets his toe under the ball and thinks it over the keeper. That's a lovely goal. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Rodri, Gundogan, Kevin De Bruyne, John Stones, breaking at pace, a fine use of the ball. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. Just wasn't a very good pass, finally. Holland. John Stones. De Bruyne. And there is the goal. Well, that changes the equation. And they have the momentum now. Well, as the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him. And so the half-time whistle is sounded here in Manchester. Well, as complete a midfield player as you're likely to see, Kevin De Bruyne. Stuart, your assessment of his performance? Yeah, he's done OK in that first half. He's had a lot of the ball, he's used it well, and he's been energetic. But unfortunately, that can't be said about the rest of the team, who need to improve if they're going to turn this around. Second half of this Champions League semi-final first leg underway. Oh, in with a chance. Off the post and back in play. And problem solved for now. Well, how did that not go in? It was a great effort, you have to say. This looks promising. And crossed in the direction of the back post. Magnificent stuff. And quite the comeback from two goals down. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box, just begging someone to get on the end of it. And Haaland made the finish look easy, as he so often does. It's a lovely goal. Counted them out. This has been quite the fight back. Modric. 
is with Vinicius Junior. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Teammates available. And crossed in there. Under pressure. Well, as you can see here, Mares gets beyond the challenge of the defender, and this is Haaland at his very best. He's composed, he shows great technique, and he just smashes it beyond the keeper. On with the game then, 3-2, what will happen next? Valverde, well timed tackle. Now can they create something? And making his move inside. Oh, it wasn't far away, but above the crossbar. Gundogan the ball back with Real now Vinicius Junior Carvajal into the advanced position goes Modric well goodness me into the goalkeeper's grateful grasp Riyad Mahrez possession changing hands Vinicius Jr. A real opening now. Oh, marvellous defending to deny him. <laughs> Vinicius Jr. Beautifully weighted ball, but mistimed his run. Well, he's got the timing all wrong there. He just needs to bide his time. And Manchester City will go to their bench. John Stones coming out of the pitch. Number two, Kyle Walker. An important interception. Vinicius. Well, they want that equaliser, but the passing remains smooth. And the keeper's hand does the trick. Jack Grealish. Well, what a magnificent save that was. It really was top-class goalkeeping. The referee has decided to get the free-kick decision the way of City. And they're making a change. They're certainly allowing their opponents to come on to them. Let's we'll see if something comes of this. Well, I must say, it did look so promising, but the flag is raised offside the verdict, Stuart. Well, he's just too eager there. It's the right run, but he's made it too early. Karim Benzema on a pass that lacks quality and the ball with De Bruyne and he's making progress this might be ideal for the counter 
Can they take advantage of the situation? Vinicius. And space to cross it. A very timely interception. And they need to get tighter. Karim Benzema. Can they square the game? Not the easiest of situations for the keeper. That's going to be a city ball. Substitution for Real Madrid. And Real come away with it. Oh, you don't want to lose the ball in that position. Still could be dangerous. Well, the keeper deserves a lot of credit. That was a fine save, wasn't it? Splendid tackle and a throw-in coming up. Out of play, City throw. Well, he's given us away. Teammates available. Good-looking ball. There could be a chance now. Just cleared away in the nick of time. Mares. Determined defending. Aurelien Chouameni. Tony Kroos. And Valverde. Real Madrid attacking, and they have to. Oh, really good reflexes and danger averted. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Corner kick delivery from Tony Kroos. Well, he dealt with that ball played in rather well. Karim Benzema. A really intense pressure applied. Options in the centre. That's well blocked. Modric. Look at Modric. Well, he really wants his brace. Well, he looks so bright today. His movement has been excellent. A corner then, and with time running out, they've got to ask questions. Not messing around with that clearance. Playing with purpose as well as control. Kroos. And let's give credit to the defending. And three minutes will be added on for stoppages. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. De Bruyne. Really high-class goalkeeping from Courtois. Another goal from his corner would in all likelihood secure victory. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, not cleared away completely. Full time then, and the lead belongs to Manchester City after 90 minutes. Yeah, that was a tight game, and I think they just about deserve their lead, but it's a slender one, and they'll certainly need to defend well in the second leg if they're to reach the final. Well, he hasn't quite had the impact and attack that we were expecting, Stuart. Well, he didn't have his best game, 
but he still played a part in the team's victory. He certainly made a contribution.